today's video, we will compare America's tallest skyscrapers. Before we go on, make sure to like this video and subscribe to Top Luxury. Be sure to let us know in the comments below which skyscraper is your favorite. Now, let's get into it. Number 16. Salesforce Tower this 326-meter-tall tower is located in downtown San Francisco, California. It is currently the tallest tower in all of San Francisco, standing almost one and a half times the height of the Golden Gate Bridge. Not only has this skyscraper won the award for the best tall building worldwide in 2019, but it has even been featured on the big screen. The Salesforce Tower was used in the 2018 action movie Venom. Plus, an animated version of the building can be seen in Big Hero 6. Number 15. Three World Trade Center Standing in Lower Manhattan, New York City, is the 329-meter-tall Three World Trade Center. The building was originally created to replace the fallen World Trade Center and is part of the bigger World Trade Center complex, which is still under construction. It features some of the largest outdoor terraces in all of New York City. Visitors can enjoy easy access to 12 subways from the inside of the building. Number 14. Wilshire Grand Center the Wilshire Grand Center is not only the tallest tower in Los Angeles, but in all of California at a height of 335 meters. Famous figures such as former President John F. Kennedy enjoyed a night in this super tall hotel. The building surpassed another record in 2014 when constructors poured 37 million kilograms of concrete or roughly five times the weight of the Eiffel Tower in a single pour in order to support its infrastructure. This earned the building a place in the Guinness Book of World Records. Number 13. Comcast Technology Center Located in Center City, Philadelphia, the Comcast Technology Center is the 13th tallest building in the United States at 342 meters. The skyscraper has everything from television studios to a restaurant on the top floor for software engineers working there to enjoy. The building contains a set of five seismic dampers to prevent heavy winds from damaging the top floors. With all that advanced technology, it's no wonder that this building cost an estimated $1.5 billion to make. Number 12. 875 North Michigan Avenue Previously known as the John Hancock Center, the 875 North Michigan Avenue skyscraper is in the magnificent Mile District of Chicago. With a height of 344 meters, it is the fifth tallest building in the city. The elevators that go to the top of the building are the fastest in the Western Hemisphere, traveling over 32 kilometers or 20 miles per hour. Visitors can zoom to the top and enjoy an observation deck that provides 360 degrees of view of Chicago. On top of that, the highest indoor swimming pool and grocery store in the country is located on the 44th floor of the building. Number 11, Aon Center. Also located in Chicago, Illinois, the Aon Center is just slightly taller than the previous skyscraper, at 346 meters. The building serves as the headquarters for the company Aon, as well as the co-headquarters for Kraft Heinz. At the time of its completion in 1973, the Aon Center was the tallest skyscraper in all of Chicago. Although it has since been stripped of that title, it is still considered one of the most impressive additions to the city's skyline. Plans for an additional $185 million observation deck are currently in the works, which would also feature a roller coaster ride on the roof. Number 10. Bank of America Tower This skyscraper in New York City is not only tall at 366 meters, but also expensive. The building is currently appraised at over $3.5 billion, making it one of the city's greatest treasures. It is considered to be one of the most environmentally conscious towers in Manhattan, as the very first skyscraper to receive Platinum LEED certification. The Bank of America Tower is made almost entirely of recycled material and includes a gray water system to use excess rainfall. The security at this bank is top of the line, as you can imagine for such an important bank in the Big Apple. 
Number 9. Empire State Building As one of the most well-known and most photographed skyscrapers in the world, the 381-meter-tall Empire State Building is an iconic addition to the Manhattan skyline. It has been named one of the Seven Wonders of the Modern World by the American Society of Civil Engineers. The building attracts over 4 million tourists from across the globe every year with multiple observatories. Over 250 television shows and movies feature a glimpse of the Empire State Building, including the film Sleepless in Seattle and the series Doctor Who. Number 8. 30 Hudson Yards just a short walk from the previous skyscraper is the 30 Hudson Yards building in Manhattan, New York City. At 387 meters tall, it features the highest observation deck in all of New York, as well as office space for major companies such as CNN and HBO. On top of that, visitors can enjoy the fitness center and movie theater inside the building. Even though this skyscraper is the sixth tallest building in New York City, it still cannot compare to the old World Trade Center Twin Towers that stood at 415 meters high. Number 7. Trump International Hotel and Tower Named after President Donald Trump, the Trump International Hotel and Tower in downtown Chicago stands at 423 meters in height. With a mix of restaurants, condominiums, and spas that offer gemstone-infused oil massages, the building has amenities on every floor. The president of McDonald's and the CEO of United Airlines both have purchased office space in the building. The skyscraper has also been featured in a variety of movies, including the 2008 film The Dark Knight, and Transformers Dark of the Moon in 2011. Trump likes to use this hotel just as a brand image because it's so recognizable in the media. Number 6. 432 Park Avenue This 426-meter tower offers a view from Central Park all the way to the Atlantic Ocean. It includes restaurants, a movie theater, and a library inside for residents of the building to enjoy. A condominium in the 432 Park Avenue skyscraper can cost up to $88 million. The building is currently the sixth tallest building in the country and the 31st tallest building in the world. Jennifer Lopez and Alex Rodriguez actually have some property at this location. Number 5. One Vanderbilt after working on the building for 10 years, Mayor Bill de Blasio and architectural firm SL Green Realty opened this 427-meter-tall skyscraper in September of 2020 in New York City. The one Vanderbilt has office space for major corporations such as TD Bank, as well as world-class dining options. Floor-to-ceiling windows allow visitors to have a 360-degree view of the city. There is more to come in time, too with the development of the Long Island Rail that would provide direct access to the building by 2022. Number 4. 111 West 57th Street Also known as the Steinway Tower, this residential building is on Billionaire's Row in Manhattan. The 435-meter-tall building is projected to be the thinnest skyscraper in the world. While construction of the building was completed in 2019, there are still some living quarter additions that the real estate company JD Development Group wants to work on before it's officially opened. This project is expected to be completed by 2021 and will offer some of the most luxurious residential spaces in New York with customized chandeliers and a 25-meter-long pool. An apartment unit can be upwards of $66 million. Number 3. Willis Tower The 442-meter-tall Willis Tower is located in the city of Chicago. It held the title of the tallest skyscraper in the Western Hemisphere for over 40 years and is now the 23rd tallest building in the world. The building's observation deck is the highest in the United States, allowing visitors to see up to 80 kilometers in the distance. Major law firms such as Morgan Stanley, as well as corporations such as United Airlines, all hold office space in the building. Plus, television and radio stations often use the rooftop of Willis Tower to hold live broadcasts. Number 2. Central Park Tower At 472 meters in height, the Central Park Tower in Midtown Manhattan is the tallest residential building in the world. 
It features one of the most exclusive clubs across the globe that offer spa treatments and personal fitness trainers. While the price of the penthouse has never been disclosed to the public, units in the building can cost anywhere from $1.5 to $60 million. Number 1. One World Trade Center Standing at 541 meters in height, the One World Trade Center skyscraper in Lower Manhattan makes the previous skyscrapers look pretty tiny. It is the tallest building in all of the Western Hemisphere and is the sixth tallest in the entire world. With official LEED Gold certification, One World Trade Center is one of the most environmentally friendly skyscrapers by operating through wind and hydroelectric power. It features office space for the United States General Services Administration and Legends, the joint venture of Yankee Global Enterprises. However, this is only one building of the much larger World Trade Center complex, which is still under construction. What do you think about America's tallest skyscrapers? Which ones have you already visited? Let us know in the comments section down